Hello engineers, welcome back to Engineering Design Simplified. In this video series, I will be solving tough engineering mechanics problems. If you want to watch more videos like this, please subscribe to my channel and press that bell button so that you will be notified when I upload a new video. Today's problem is a hammer of mass 0.25 lb hits a nail of negligible mass with a velocity of 40 feet per second. Find the impulse on the nail. The hammer stays in contact with the nail while it comes to rest. Neglect the impulse caused by the weight of the hammer head during contact with the nail. In this problem, given is a hammer of 0.25 lb weight hits the nail with the velocity of 40 feet per second. So in this problem, we need to find impulse on this nail. Let us see in the coming slides how to solve this problem. First, let us see impulse momentum diagram for the hammer. So initially, the hammer weight is 0.25 lb and it moves with a velocity of 40 feet per second. So initial momentum of the hammer can be written as mv1. So and there are impulsive forces, its own weight, uh, hammer's weight will be acting vertically downwards and a resistive force from nail is going to act in the upward direction. So the impulsive forces can be written as sigma integral of f dt. So uh, that can further be written as integral of w that is a vertical uh, weight acting downwards minus f the resistive force acting upwards into dt integral of w minus f into dt. So after hitting the nail and the hammer and nail will come to rest uh, then uh, the velocity of the hammer and nail together uh, that is v2 will become zero and its weight is acting downwards. So in this problem uh, weight of the na nail is uh, negligible so we are taking only weight of the hammer here. So since v2 is zero so final momentum of the hammer and nail uh, that is mv2 will be zero. So here this uh, impulse momentum equation mv1 plus integral of w minus f into dt equal to mv2. So in this uh, impulsive forces so in this problem also given that uh, impulse uh, due to weight of the hammer is neglected. That means integral of W dt from this term uh, we neglect that. So and V2 is 0. So this equation can be written as mv1 minus integral of f dt equal to 0. So in this impulse momentum equation uh, m is the mass of the hammer and v is the initial velocity of the hammer and f is the resistance from the uh, by the nail and dt is the time during which impact happens. So this equation can be written as integral of f dt equal to mv1. So let us substitute the values that is uh, m is the weight divided by acceleration due to gravity in FPS system that is 0.25 by 32.17 into v1 initial velocity 40 uh, feet per second. So after simplification we get uh, impulse on nail integral of f dt equal to 0 0.311 lb second. That's all for today's video. If you like this content, please like, share and subscribe. Thanks for watching.